Hello everybody, this is the Gamesers, and I am back on some videos. I apologize for not, uh, having any for quite a while, but I was waiting to get a new editing software, which I have. Uh, I also apologize for not being able to get out a, uh, uh, a Skyblock episode, but, uh, that's about it. Uh, I'm just getting, uh, all of the uh, apologies out of the way so I can start on the video. Uh, anyway, I'm going to be doing a settings video for Rust, uh, as you can tell, that's what I am playing at the moment. Uh, I am... I did do a couple things to make it run better. Uh, I will show them up on the screen right now. But... Yeah, uh, if you do those things while you're running on this graphics card, uh, it should be fine. I'm playing on the, uh, fastest quality settings, which will, it'll, uh, come up when you, uh, like, uh, when you launch the game. So it'll ask which graphics you want to play on, and if you want to play in windowed mode or not. And, uh, when you go into, uh, uh, into the actual game, you press, uh, F1 and type in, uh, the things that I just showed you. And, yeah, uh, that should make your game run, uh, pretty good, because right now, while recording, I'm running at, a 12 to 13 FPS with Fraps, and, uh, Fraps is, uh, as a lot of you that record know, is a very, uh, computer-heavy, um, or graphics-heavy recording software? I don't know the term for it. But at the moment, you start off with, uh, with a rock, two bandages. I found two in a, uh, a little searching thing. Right now I'm being radiated, which isn't that good. Oh, crap, I'm being chased. No! No, go away! No, zombie! Oh, crap. Oh, no, this isn't good. I don't think you can outrun red zombies. This is a bad thing. Oh, God. I'm, I'm just going to keep running uh, until I'm safe. And while I'm doing that, I will uh, explain to you what FPS I get uh, while I'm not recording. Uh, on these settings, uh, after turning off uh, grass and... Uh, GFX dot green, uh, I get around 25 to, uh, or 20 to 34 FPS, uh, which is pretty good. Uh, at the moment, uh, I would be playing in, uh, on the server that I normally play on, but I couldn't find it for some reason. Uh, I was waiting for, like, so long, and uh, it just wasn't turning up. What the heck is going on? Uh, sorry about that. That was a weird lag spike. Anyway, I would be playing on the server that I normally do, but for some reason I couldn't find it, and uh, I just said, well, screw it, I might as well just get the video over with. But uh, at the moment, I have a, uh, a one-story house that is completed with a furnace, a uh, workbench, crafting table thing. Uh, I have a pipe shotgun, a uh, revolver, a uh, hunting bow, and uh, a couple other things that are uh, pretty good. I have a ton of food, too, which is pretty great. But, uh, sadly, I'm not able to use it because I couldn't find the server at the moment. But, yeah, Rust is definitely a really good game. I went into it not really expecting very much, uh, but I ended up playing, like, four hours that day, which was a couple days ago. So I am pretty new to Rust. I haven't found, uh, literally any blueprints except for a 9mm pistol, which I literally just found on this server while I was over at those buildings. So, uh, at the moment I'm just showing you, like, the basics, uh, mining the, uh, stones to get, uh, sulfur, uh, metal ore, and stones, which you need to, uh, craft things, and, uh, a ton of wood. I would definitely recommend, uh, mining wood piles instead of trees, because, uh, as you can see, I get about, like, seven wood per, uh, hit on it, and, uh, for a tree, sometimes you don't even get one. Uh, as I'll show you, like, right now. You get, like, one per hit, and sometimes you don't even get one per hit, which is pretty annoying, which is why I like, uh, using these. And, uh, you'll definitely need a ton of metal. Uh, a lot of metal and stones. Uh, so if you spawn in and you see, like, a bunch of stones and wood piles around you, get as much as possible because you will, uh, definitely want it later on. Like... All of these uh, rocks that you see here, I'll give you uh, metal and uh, sulfur and stones. And uh, 
those are very helpful after uh, a while. You use uh, stones for making a stone hatchet and uh, arrows and a furnace. And you use the furnace, obviously, to smelt the sulfur and uh, metal. So you can get uh, metal fragments and uh, sulfur, which you use the uh, sulfur to ma uh, to mix with charcoal that you get from uh, burning wood uh, to make uh, gunpowder, which you'll need a ton of to make ammo, or uh, shells for shotgun, which is, I guess you could say ammo. But uh, yeah, I definitely do recommend it. It does run really good after uh, you turn the render distance uh, down all the way and uh, uh, do stuff like that. But uh, yeah, I guess this is basically uh, all I have for today. So uh, thank you all for watching. This has been The Gamesers, and uh, peace out.